Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to My Friendly Neighborhood, which is a horror game where you must survive a bunch of killer Muppets. I saw something. I felt something, maybe. It was more real than reality. I felt like I was lost, walking through this dark tunnel, and the ground beneath me stretched on for an eternity. I felt like I was dying. Well, he swerved out of his lane, striking a passenger van that started a pile up, killing seven. In weather, we'll all be sad to see another band of thunderstorms heading toward the city tomorrow night. I just had this insane sense of of um, emptiness and terror, and I just, I just... I don't care who she sees. We're not even married anymore. She can see whoever she wants. So, so, Ashley, what did you do to end up solving the problem? I ignored it. Tried to forget. I watched television. And that helped? It dulls the pain. Are you gonna scare the alley and go through other people? Ignoring their own lives. Okay, last job of the day. What's this one about? Let's see. Vacant studio lot became power last night and began televising over top normal programming. The client has requested that the broadcast array on top of the central hotel be disabled to prevent further incidents. Criminal Brian is on probation for sullen and impolite behavior towards clients. Failure to satisfactorily complete this work order will result in termination. Damn. Check this. Oh, I'm not eating that. That's been there for days. I'm not leaving yet. I just got here. Nice. Disabled antenna. The last job of the day is always the worst. Before we go in, let's look over here. Ricky, we're friends. Secret entrance. Nice. Looks like a crank could go here. Hi, buddy. Some sort of slot. There's an elevator. Maybe it still works. Purple goo? This glue? Thank you. We did see the thing earlier so today, I could use those. Need money. Don't got no money. Ring me. Okay. Raise the 
the curtain. Bring up the lights. The neighborhood is coming to town. Uh, hello. I I'm here to disconnect the antenna. Television's heartbeat has returned. A spirit of cheer brightens every child's eye. The cry goes round the kindergarten class. The neighborhood. The neighborhood. Okay. I I'm here to disconnect the antenna. I am Ricky the Sock. Your television will never be the same. We- hold on. Did you say disconnect the antenna? Yes. Oh my, no, 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 no. You mustn't do that. That would be a catastrophe. It's broadcasting over the news. The news? No, no, trust me. The antenna is just fine as it is. Doesn't need any disconnecting. Tell you what, you wait here and I'll... <clears throat> and I'll, uh... I'll get, I'll get you some... <clears throat> oh, that wasn't pleasant. I'm gonna take a sec. Um... Okay then. Okay. Stage four. That was... special. So if you never saw the demo of this, I did play a demo uh, before. Looks like something could be placed here. Interesting. You're the last one. This area's off limits. Locked from the other side. Locked. Come on, buddy. Hey, who's that? Look over here real quick. We're good. Empty. Not empty. And tokens. This week saw the premiere of a new series in the City Network aimed at preschool-aged children, My Friendly Neighborhood. The show centers on the titular Friendly Neighborhood and its resident puppets, who with the help of adults like Stevie, teaches viewers about a variety of subjects including numbers, letters, and how to be a friendly neighbor. The show's catch-all term for age-old lessons about caring and sharing, and by being a friendly neighbor, don't blast your computer, Mac speakers, while playing RuneScape. While adult viewers may find their messages trite, children's hearts are captured by neighbors. Each felt furball becomes a beloved friend whose words are hung on to with a trust and devotion rarely seen in older audiences. Previously aired as Ricky and Friends on independent public access television, the series, and the creator Al Gerswald, recently signed by the City Network Broadcasting Group and production moved to the historic City Network Hotel Studio on the west side. The move to the big leagues of broadcasting is coming by... to recite too. Let me show you. Uh, <clears throat> Whoa! <laughs> oh, God. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Let me do another. <laughs> Figures through. No, no. <clears throat> Yay! I love that one. At the end of the day, it's basically a zombie. <laughs> What the heck is going on here? You give me 
a task, and I'll give you a craft. I like to start with pipe cleaners to get myself something to make shapes out of. I'll make triangles nice. and squares and circles and patch them all together. Then the fun part starts. Take your closest friend and separate all of their parts into little piles based on color. This will be what you make your craft. I'm here to educate the children. No, you're not. Oh, it's Pirate Cove. Oh man, I love that movie. What we got here? Elf Lax. Magazines. There we go. There's the inventory. Don't have our gun yet, though. Might have overlooked it, too. Neighborhood is having an outdoor bazaar. Everyone is lining up at Leonard's antique display to try on a beautiful pair of earrings. Pearl enters, sees the earrings, cuts into a line, pushing Leon out of the way and causing a commotion. Stevie, standing up from the bench. Pearl, that wasn't nice! Pearl sheepishly glances around the others who are all glowering at her and hunches in shame. You can't just push people out of the way to get what you want, Pearl! It's more friendly to think about other people first, do you see? Pearl shakes her head timidly. Well, maybe this will make it clear. Put on another before yourself. Okay, we're getting out of here. Yes. So the duct tape is a, uh... It was a... It's a pretty important mechanic. It was in the demo. But basically all the enemies... They're, they're unkillable. You can only, uh... Duct tape them up later. Can I sneak up on and do that? No, you got I'm a friend. <laughs> we can teach them. We can teach them. I'm here. So duct tape would be best used in places you're going to be going through a lot. It's locked. Okay, at least I have one basic weapon. Down in front of your face. See? That's too high. No. <laughs> hey. Stay, stay back. When he's knocked over, you can tape them. Later, buddy. Still like you can touch some period. It's it's an auto grab. Tools. I will take that. Take the tokens. Put this into the stash. Keep that there for now. Inspect. Take the tokens. Heal. Unlock that. This led back to the beginning, pretty much. Well, 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 it's time for well, blow! La, 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 hey! Okay, going in. Again, I've got some snackaroos waiting back in the lobby. Hey, what's going on here? Your puppet friends are attacking me. Oh, are they? How embarrassing. By the way, what's your name? What? Your name, your moniker, your handle, your nom de plume. It's Gordon. Gordon? What a beautiful name. I could say it all day. Gordon. 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 Is this a gun? Does it work? Oh my, that's where I left that. I've been looking for it all over the place. Blah. Blah. Fine. If you're gonna go gallivanting all over the place, then at least watch out for Pearl. Pearl? You know, the enormous bird that crushes people. Don't get on her bad side is all I <laughs> What was that?
Okay, let's do this. It is when you start coughing after we they start pounding on the door. Yeah, she's there out rolling back. She mean at all. Well. Okay, I can do it. You can go on. That's probably a good way to use that. In your alphabet, huh? Get him stunned with this and then go in for this. Cause the the hitbox for them grabbing it is like really big. Also, we burn through ammo like nothing. I learned my numbers. Hey! Hey! No! Whoa! Take you, uh. Take these. Thank you. Reload. Yeah. Unlock that. Sometimes you can, like. Take him down easy. Other times, like you don't really hit him very well. That works. Thank you. Now that we're back here, we get the circle key, which we can't use here because we need a diamond key there. We can go back. No point in the loading. Later. Oh yeah, you're still around. God, the grabs are big. A little drawing. Pizza. Lots of food in here, actually. It's tape shot. Just, just break the tape. Is that a whale? Not touch. I'm a craft monster. You're on the other end of this area now. Cheap unlocked like secret. The one guy's gone. I'm assuming he busted through there. Going with the store. Wow. This must be one of the old sets. Oh god, there's so many of them. Don't necessarily want to fight all these Muppets. Lock from the other side. Hey, yeah, look. Welcome to the friendly neighborhood. Yeah. Friendly. Ish. Oh god, they talk so much. That's Whoa, bird. Quite a bird. You plan to move it all? Don't fall. Looks <laughs> like an open, but a lid won't lift. Mushrooms are this way. Thank you. Where? Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Oh, man, that's gonna hurt. Oh, it's just tossing me around. Yeah, it just... That, that thing was not cutting it. Uh, ma, ma, ma. <laughs> I'm a 
Hey bird. You sad? What are you looking at? Oh, maybe it's not actually that dangerous. Yeah, it's not attacking. What's wrong? What are you sad about? Huh? It it literally just acting like a bird. So that's a little interesting, so it is not a threat. At least yet. Finish it. Oh, it looks pretty angry right there. Go. Over here. I used to be responsible. Uh oh. Like going through here, I forced everything to respawn. Let me show you how I learn. Hold your hands up in the air. Now bring them down in front of your face. See, that's true. Thank you. Now take one of your hands and put it into your mouth and swallow as hard as you can. Now you have one hand and slow your stomach and one of your outside. This is the best one. Good here. Now you have two hands in your stomach. What well, I don't see the mailman, but someone else has spawned over there. I'm a crafty monster. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Oh. No hot! Oh. <laughs> 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 Ooh, dangerous. friends are for. They give you new fingers to use. <laughs> okay, the candy bar makes. Oh my god, that's really useful. Oh my god, the grab! We can teach them! There's so many doors, and I'm like... I'm scared to go into any of them because... Well, I taped you. Apparently I taped you, like, unintentionally. I was hitting keys. But it's fine. You weren't the worst of ones to tape. Ah. Uh, okay. No guy filmed down, it looks like. Fish. Fish on my plate. There. It's locked. Whoa! Yes, right. Let's go up here. I 
I mean, that unlocked a certain area. Here's never letter. Thank you. Oh, I didn't check this area out before. Never learn I need there. Detour. What is this? Glasses? Classic eyeballs in the back. Let's go in the main building. Well, well, well. It's time for, uh, what does Norman notice? Oh, let's see here. Uh, what does Norman notice? Uh, ah, Norman notices. Well, you, uh, having some trouble there, my friend? Okay, there's a safe room in here. Let's give the bird back its glasses. Maybe that'll help us progress here quite a bit. Hey, you need some eyes? Look down. Down here. I can help you out. There you go. You can see now. Yeah, so yeah, you can see. You're also pushing the Muppets around. Okay. Admiring yourself there. I guess we can go into here from uh, this place. Jump down. Yeah, you're a friend, all right. Friend to these letters I'm shooting out. Square key, that's exactly what we need. There's another block, there's some save coins. There's some few other places we can use this key. One was here. Thank you. I never let her. Need one more. 
Let's see if we can now run everyone here. Whoa, 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 Where are we starting? Where are we starting now? Oh my god. He's dead spiritually. Actually, no, I think it's still alive. It's kind of a Muppet. They don't really die. Should be the last letters. <laughs> Neighbor! Got a letter. Letter goes into that mailbox over there. And we should be good. Got a crank. Maybe this unlocks a different part of the studio. I think it's gone later in the day, right? The like time is actually has like passed. So anyway, that's locked. So we have to go to the secret entrance. This is the, uh, the demo area. Oh dear, oh my. You seem to be stranded in the basement. How do I get out of here, Ricky? Oh, having a clue. Never come down here myself. Why? What's got your overalls in a knot? I'm trying to get to the roof. The roof? <laughs> What's so interesting about the roof? Down here's much more intriguingly musty. Unrelated, how do you feel about blunt force head trauma? What is it this time? Well, Ray, of course. He's the best sort of monster janitor thing. But he's a little obsessed with, uh, organic maintenance. Tends to pop out of pipes and clobber people with his wrench. Great. Are all of you puppets crazy? Well, Ray has always been a little grouchy, even before the shutdown. That's why they moved him down here. Only way out is by elevator, and he can't figure out how to use the buttons. Elevator. Got it. Oh, silly me. I forgot about the elevators. Really, Gordon, I wouldn't bother. The cables are probably rusted. I don't think they even run anymore. I'll take my chances. Wow, you're so courageous and stuff. Look, I gotta go... Wash my hair. You're gonna be the last boss of this game, aren't you? Stupid puppets. Lock and load. After 20 years of fighting, the city government has finally declared a complete withdrawal of troops from the northern continent. Called the War of Horrors, a conflict which mainly involved guerrilla confrontations in the forests. Confrontations, rather. Resulted in almost 100,000 casualties. Unlike previous homecomings, veterans returning to the city's main docks were booed and hissed reflecting the negative attitude of many adults toward those who volunteered to serve in the war, hoping to protect their home, in the eyes of the public helping to per perpetrate these horrors. The Norbert War has also been called the first war fought in the living room, due to the televised newsreel that kept civilians at home update with events overseas. I mean, if you go by the date, like, it's, it's basically supposed to be a Vietnam War parallel. I want to go here first. I don't remember the, the demo layout. Well, we're commanded here. You're not 
bothering anyone. You are. Ooh, it was close. Be friendly to your neighbors. No swearing. Useless. Useful. Useless. Useful. Useful. Useless. Weird. Extremely useful, I'm assuming. Oh! It's a dude. Oh man, I missed that thing over there. It's locked. Might have done this in the wrong order. Mouse. I'm gonna tape you. You have the capacity of spawning close to uh, where I need to go. left. Yes, yeah, where I want to be. Useless. Useful. Useless. Useful. Useful. I was hanging around the office last night to keep the pipes from freezing, so I had the time to work out the kinks in my latest project. The output's pretty flashy, but uses a lot of litter, so I need to conserve ammo. Yep, me tape. Always. Never have enough. Let's get writing. Alright, inventory's getting a little bit more messy. Lock from the other side. So let's go in the main area. Sometimes we would swap our arms, then we would swap our legs. One by one, each I may have to do some taping. This is like an important area, I think. <laughs> yeah, sure you did. Take you up. Alright. Thank you. Mouse. Oops. The mice are the perpetrator of the entire game. Just mice and like... Muppet outfits. Hey, who's there? Uh oh. Thank you. As Stevie and Ricky enter, Ray's workshops are overflowing of enormous piles of sewage. Ray, where are you? Ray emerges from behind a large pile of sludge, slowly eyes downcast. Ray, what gives? Everyone's sinks are overflowing. All the drains are clogged up with junk. Ray growls half-heartedly. 
I see. Someone made fun of your plumbing, and now you're too embarrassed to keep on working. Ray whimpers and nods. A pipe rattles and groans, being more gunk into the growing pile. Ray, if we don't get screwed up soon, isn't the sewer going to blow up and destroy the entire city? Wait. Ray, sometimes people make fun of us, even when we're doing the right thing. That's just how people are. But you can't let them tell you how to be friendly. What was that? Ray. Put Fang into Fang. And you get Boy, Fang. Do I have just a thing for you? <laughs> Mouse. You got that rubber ducky, friend? Now the map. <laughs> oh yeah, now Ray is active. Yeah, uh-huh. Get going when we get a chance. Oh. Do the construction of new stages as blast door has been locked using a punch card combination. Uh, looks like it needs power. Take this. Need a uh, key for that one. Everybody's looking all right. We do get the power source, so so we're good. Take this. Two plus two square minus one triangle. Six O. Okay, let's put the power in. Oh yeah, I forgot the. Now once you go here. Okay, that's one down. This one should go here. Number one down. And we need a seven. Huh, it's a little red thing up there. There you go. We good. Okay, more wow. caves. I wonder how deep this goes. As deep as you want it. As deep as the lore of a Super Mario 64. Did you know every one of those is customized? Unique to each person? Okay, I'm gonna try to be a little, like, cheap and... I feel like I can launch you into that. I learned my numbers when I was a kid! <laughs> Here, let it get you. Now, I learned. Let me 
tell you about the time that I played. Shoot, no, bud. No, 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 First time. Go this way first. Boat. I think this takes me back to the uh, starting area. Just save right there, unlock that. Useful. Useful also. And if we check this out... Yep, we are back towards the uh, starting area. Okay. Let's go back in here. See where this leads. Somewhere important. Very much so. Let's uh, take the high road first. Yeah, this looks promising. Cool. Find that ammo for sure. Letter to the editor. As the mother of a four year old who is devoted to my friendly neighborhood, I'm frightened by the tone of the morals on that show. Just yesterday, one of the characters said, You should always think of others before yourself, even when it's uncomfortable. What if someone takes advantage of you for doing that? What if doing what's uncomfortable ends up exposing you to hurt and danger? Is it a really good idea to teach children to be so reckless of their own well being? I want my daughter to live the fullest life she can, so I don't want some TV producer filling her head with dangerous, self-sabotaging ideas. I think from now on she'll be watching something else. I'm trying to figure out where this has been leading me. Mm, ammo ones and saves. Go this way first. Ooh, this could be bad. Mouse. Nope. Strange kind of breaker box. Someone keeps taking the breakers to use to open these doors. Put them in these lock boxes around the basement. Okay, that's good. Now we can actually make a little bit of progress. Because we've been passing by these, uh... things, not able to do anything about them. Breakers do take up inventory space. I should put one in there. Oh man, they've spawned people out here now. I have to tape at least one of you. The other one I can probably aggro around. Let's be excellent. Let's be excellent. Let's be excellent. Let's not be excellent. I can spew all sorts of things. We're not Bill and Ted. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. <laughs> I'm trying to count to ten. To ten. There's one kind of buried right there. 
I'm gonna try to do something here. Yep. Mouse. Oh yeah, this is the uh, end game right here. Well, for this stage anyway. Get out of here. Right hand door unlocked. That means a different combination opens the other door. You people aren't gonna come to life, are you? No food in your equipment. Must sign. Neighbors don't weigh enough, don't worry about them. Hmm. No room in the toolbox. There is now. Yeah, it's, it's just very long. Totally down with the one key, too, if you want to, like, worry about that. Alright, let's go on the bolt. Uh-oh. Deep in stinky water. Sounds like a fetish. <laughs> Unlock that. And we're back here. Which we can use to our advantage to cut the uh, one chain. I'm not dealing with you. Test us out. Yep. I'm gonna cut this chain. Okay. Chain cutter is uh, useless now. Mouse. Secret. This must be the elevator Ricky was talking about. We should be in new territory now. TV studio. Locked. Locked also. Great. It's starting again. Oh boy. All visitors must check in. God, this place is swarming with them. Locked. Of course it is. So we're not gonna get a shortcut to outside. Not yet, anyway.
Only ring bell once. Yeah, that's right. Oh yeah, look, they're filming that dog is kinda scary. I suppose I should start using my uh shotgun a little more. On the war, reflection. Last month marks seven years since the end of the war, so it seems like a good time to reflect on the impact it has on our lives. I think across the whole city the war has left us feeling troubled. We were called to service for the sake of righteousness, love for one city and protecting others. But in the end we found that those calls were just noble lies, and behind them the horror of reality forded our starry-eyed ideals. We left home as heroes and came home as murderers. But this tension leads to a question. Why should we care about right and wrong, or friendliness? As a children's show puts it, following such things can have a terrible cost. The only reason one would be if there was some overarching purpose, some guiding goodness to our wanderings in the world. But that's exactly what injustice like the war calls into question. Perhaps it's time to put aside those old ideas. Perhaps it's time to look for the other sources of hope. Perhaps a wise man is the one who lives for himself. Hmm. Not working. I'm done in this area. Let's go into the hellhole area. That'll be fun. Oh no. Oh my god. You might be able to not take you out. Uh, never mind. This is like something from a horror movie. The sort of thing that moves as soon as you turn your back. You need a oh god, they do attack. Oh man, that's gonna hurt. They're static. Whoa, whoa. These are horrible. Well, it is a save room. But it's in a funny spot. Some more tape. Or a coin. Velvet mask. Oh my god, these things. Ooh, it's a cheeseburger. So we're gonna go on up then. A hat. Um, a lot of things are kind of scattered all over the place. There's another one of those things. Punctuation. We have grenades. I have a feeling they're gonna make me use them pretty soon. Locked. All those Muppets are gonna wake up and go to party on me. Every single one. Anything over here? Nope. Anything in the seat? I can't even go into the seats. Banana. Toolbox, size 4. 
Yeah, I need a 4x4 four four space. So I will heal. Move some things around. Take that and prepare as a bunch of enemies come here. Yeah, that is actually really effective. Gosh, she's right behind me. So I went back and put some of my ammo and mask and stuff away. Um, they were taking up a lot of space. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh, nice. They've taken a return to my inventory pretty soon. Exactly what I mean. Ricky Dance. I still think Ricky's like the antagonist. Um, and they keep bringing up this war. So, like... Where... Where is that gonna come in? Big Heist. When you go to the park, bring some food for all the wild animals! I'm probably gonna start taping some people. I see. Locked. Locked also. Take you out. Take that so I can like, explore this area freely. Also because my inventory is getting a little full. Go in here. Look, got some tape. I will take that. Got some more ammo too. Almost missed that coin. That would have been upsetting. Cool guy. Oh my god. What the heck was that? Music. Music. Oh, I love it so much. You've never heard music. I'm not going back that way. What do you do when you get upset? Do you let it get you down? Let me tell oh yeah, you definitely. Take you out. This looks like the um, a certain Resident Evil one kind of corner. We may have to tape you up. Because we're going to be passing back through this area. This area sucks. What do you do when you get upset? Do you let it get you down? Let me tell you about the time my friend Leonard got me all hey! Whoa! 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 No more. Tape you because this is a crossroads with no real way to like go around you all. Secret. Wallow inside of that love. 
TV studio. When you go to the park, oh, sure is, uh, oh my god. Sure is lonely these days, huh? Oh, maybe I can uh, talk to my, my Echo. Hello! Oh, hey there! The audience cheers, excited music plays. Oh, he left. So Leaping can Wait, be what? the best part of your day. I always start by getting ready for bed. First, I get my PJs on so I can be warm and comfy all night. Next, I go to the bathroom and grab my toothbrush. You can put any of your favorite condiments on your Puzzle? I choose Worcestershire sauce. Then, I start for rushing my teeth. Get every single part of your mouth covered and scrub the Worcestershire cider drop, sauce deep into the skin of your mouth. I will take that. Then, you're all done, Don't have that key yet. So it can form a protective layer during the night. Now you're all ready to go. Sleep well. Fight. About you. Just take your hand, make oh, three lines, ma, and connect them together. Ma, ma, ma. Okay. Oh. Now, draw a line. Oh. Oh. One from your side. Oh, ma, 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 ma. I think we're done here for right now. We're all friendly here. Friendly no, you're not. God, you really took some punishment. <laughs> Tempted to tape you up. Yeah, I'm pretty full. Yeah. yeah, we'll do it. You might, uh... Again, this is a choke point area. Got it. Whatever I did, I, I got it. Oh. Let's play the game. Press the ball, bell to start. When it's your turn, I would draw a card or play a card to move that many spaces. First to the end wins. Special spaces. If you land on Norman, draw a card. Junebug is wild. If you start your turn on Junebug, immediately play the top card of the deck. Poor Leonard is slow. If you're on Leonard, you only play one. If you're on Goblet, you lose. Okay, let's play. Draw a card or play a card. Let's, um, is this free spaces or what? Hey, one. You can't do that. Oh, oh. <clears throat> Guess I gotta follow the rules. Okay. So two. Okay. So I'm going to play two again. Let's lay out a three. And we're going to do a one. Do uh, two. We need to draw a card. Do number two. I will draw. Oh. 
Okay, I win. Give me the key. Well, I would take the key. There we go. Oh my god, there's items everywhere. Guys, can someone please play that MFN game with Norman in the rec room? He's been waiting around for days again, and it's starting to affect my target times, knowing he's staring at the back of my head. Barry, Barry, I can't find the second player's token. Norman won't let me play with anything else. Does someone pick up as part of the ever game? Claris, I'm sorry, Claire, I grabbed it as part of a chess set. Don't worry, I stopped by this afternoon, played a couple of rounds with him, afterwards I sent him home. So we did all that. The safe has been sold to keep vulnerable items out of the hands of the neighbors. I don't want to include the combination here in case some of them can read. But let's just say it'll help you see the flip side of things. Let's go up here. It's a new area. I really need to like invis go to a stash. So we'll come back. Uh. Okay, you do like a, you do like a bull charge. We do have a diamond key. Can unlock that. Okay. Our friends feel a lot of feelings. Juba had a good day. Norman had a bad day. Liliana found a big mouse. George got cut off in traffic. Masks. Where am I now? All space. Inventory is getting a little bit fat. Lock and load. Lock from the other side. Let's see what's in here. There's an angry mask. Need that. Thank you. And that is clear. So can be the Let's come back here. Let's unlock day. this door. Start by getting ready for bed. First, See what mask I need. So I can be and comfy all night. Next, I go to can have a save coin. You can put any of your favorite condiments and I mean, we're not technically done. But there was this area. We didn't really explore much of this because our inventory was full. Inspect. Because we need something for this area. We need some film. Insert reel in the projector, press course my button to start projection. Seamlessly loops the film by asynchronously rewinding from the collection reel during playback. Okay. You guys sure give me a lot of ammo around here. Using room on toolbox. Puppets in space, out of touch of reality. There's nothing particularly wrong- oh, two out of five stars. There's nothing particularly wrong with puppets in space. The latest addition to the My Might Friendly Neighborhood Media franchise. Once again, we join the puppets as they embark on another grand adventure. This time on a journey to find the planet Oblong. And once again, or it's Oblong, I don't know. Once again, they are joined by a hapless B tier celebrity to provide some dramatic core to the neighbor's antics. It's all well constructed and even amusing. The problem is that it's just what we've come to expect from Gerswald's felt friends. 
What stands out most about the film is the sheer bareness of the translunar landscape. And it just don't just mean visually. Here there are no dazzling treasures, celebrity dreams, or gut-wrenching crime sprees to hold the audience's attention. All that space has is MF's entire childish moral vision. Even when they travel to the other side of the universe, the puppets can only offer the same moth-eating yarn. Damn. Well, we'll be back. You find a mouse, and you have a bad day. I have absolutely no idea what I just did. So, um, you gave me a bunch of dice. I wonder if I'm a lot of use. Huh. Curious. We gotta put the masks back, by the way, in our inventory, because there was another area where we could have used them in the uh, one main building. Okay, let's do this thing now. You... you happy? Did I... pick the right one? Did it matter? No, no. We will be back here, actually, going by the map. So this does have to be, um, yeah. We do have to resolve this. Now, the diamond key should still have some purposes in the other, like, locations. Machine room, live audience. Got some more tape. These are the hydraulics for the elevator. Where's the fluid tank? How would I know? I'm sure finding some ammo around here. All you're doing is just banging the wall. We'll leave you alone, buddy. Get that? I'm just gonna eat that right now. That. A, B, C, D, e, F, G. We're definitely <laughs> done here. I'm here to educate the children. They will clever until your ears. We can yep. teach them. We can teach them. So we should be able to do this now. Okay. And then there was a hint. About it. I forgot the note. I'll look at my, uh, files. Ah! That's simple. And then a six right here. That story is correct. And then a five. Something clicked. There's the tank. Oh my god, I need more inventory space. Need eight slots. Boy. Okay, tanks on. 
They should fix that elevator. Yeah, I'm not jumping down on that. That is a trap. No, stop saying jump. Bathroom? Oh. Useless. Useless. Wait. No smiley face. That's useful. Never film real. Don't hog. Well, it really is deep in stinky water. It's just dark in here. That is another, um... Puppies? Huh. That's pretty important for something. So let's put another, uh... Film reel in. I'm assuming we need one more. And I think it might be a multi-ending game. Because if you look at the achievement they see it's the war. There's some kind of connection to the war and the Muppets. Is she depressed? You okay? No, I can't uh, change it. I mean, let's try going down. Yeah, they're still here crying. Can I help you? Life can get you down sometimes, huh? First time I ever saw a movie as a kid. There was this scene of a man riding into this big, blazing sunset, and I remember when it came up, it just caught me. I don't know if it was the plot or the music or what, but my heart just suddenly leapt, like... like I had just heard an old friend calling my name. And I sort of forgot myself and turned around, thinking someone was behind me. But all I saw was a little star of light coming from the projection booth. No one else turned around. They all were just focused on the screen. But it felt so real. So solid. <laughs> Never knew what to make of that. And eventually I forgot about it. I guess during the war I got distracted. But it just came back to me now. You take it easy, okay? Live life to your fullest. As a giant frog muppet. So like I was saying, um in in the achievements, they mentioned helping the main mascots. And it, it, there was looks like there was an implication of like multiple endings, maybe at least two or three. So that's either it's either the choice is, has nothing to do with that and you have to help everybody. Or, um, those will come into play in the ending.